day guys, uh, I'm Wilson here. I'm going to teach you today on how to create a CD label sticker design using the Photoshop. Okay, firstly, uh, okay, open up your Photoshop, any version. Okay, now we'll open a new layout and we will name it as CD label 1. Okay, the width will use 12 cm times height 12 cm. That's a proper size for the CD label design. The res resolution should be 300 pixel per inch and the mode should be CMYK which is we will use for printing later. Okay, first we will use a fixed size of 12 cm times 12 cm of a uh, round lab round uh, um, uh, design and we'll put a grey background outside. Okay, next we will use a 6 cm guide vertical and 6 cm guide horizontal. This is to give you a idea of which is the center of the label. And now we'll add the small circle in the center. Since we are using a in inkjet label sticker, we'll, the circle should be 1.5 cm times 1.5 cm, but it's up to you to use a bigger circle in for your label sticker. It could be 2.4 cm as well for those replication CD. Okay, next we will add the background image for this uh, design. Okay, pick the one that you wanted. Okay, then we'll cut it and paste it here. Okay, this is in a layer form, so we can adjust it later. So now we need to enlarge it so it get the height of the CD label. Now we'll adjust the position of the design so you'll get, you'll get the proper background design for your CD label later. Okay, you can take your time to adjust it until you finalize uh, which is the best position of the background image. Then obviously, uh, normally people add on additional things like logo or wording to it to make it a proper CD uh, design. Now we'll add this GST uh, logo to it. Okay, We don't want the white background, so you'll use the magic wand and remove the white part of the background of the logo. So now you get a proper logo and we have to string it down to get a smaller size and position it into the center. Okay, sorry for the interruption here. Okay, next we will use the wording to be added to the CD label design. So it looks like a proper CD label design with logo, with background, and with wording. Okay, once you get the proper wording, position it into the center. And you need to resize it to a proper size for the CD label. And you can also change the color of the wording so you get a more sharper uh, wording so people can see clearly in onto your label later. Okay, we also can add additional effect like blending with stroke, white stroke, so it looks sharper onto the design. We'll resize it again and reposition it properly. So, so that's how we need to do some uh, review and editing again to get a proper CD label design. Okay, next we will try to add additional logo or any anything uh, necessary to the CD label design. Some they have uh, additional sponsorship logo or uh, like CD audio or DVD video logo to it. Okay, I try to find one here. Uh, let's say I want to put a CD audio logo but I just couldn't find a way I save it. So it's okay. This is, will be the final design and we'll save it as CD label 1 in PSD format. This for future editing and we'll resave it again in JPEG format. And this is something we cannot edit. And this is for printing purpose later. 
So thank you guys for watching.